Residents here in San Juan are getting ready as Hurricane Maria heads this way. Now, the island was spared a direct hit from Irma, but locals here have seen what a deadly Cat 5 hurricane can do, and they're taking no chances. This morning, round two, the Caribbean in the crosshairs again, this time from Maria, another potentially destructive hurricane, now strengthening, following almost the identical path of devastation left by Irma. Are you nervous? Yes, very. Just days after the ferocious Category 5 storm tore through the islands, leaving thousands without homes and businesses demolished, Hurricane warnings and watches are up again. Hurricane Maria. We've got watches, we've got warnings. Nobody wants them, but we have them. Residents who just got through Irma are now heading back to the grocery store to stock up on food and water. And plywood is a big seller again. It's been devastating. It's been very stressful for everyone. Even the private Caribbean island of billionaire Richard Branson wasn't spared. I've never experienced anything quite like Hurricane Irma. It's given me a lot of respect for nature. And with Maria bearing down, he tweeted, another massive storm is underway and may do more damage to already wounded communities. Stay safe, seek shelter. As the Caribbean braces for Maria, residents in the hard-hit Florida Keys are doing what they can to clean up the mess left by Irma. We'll just keep working, trying to get everything back to normal, restore everything, and I think before we know it, we'll be back up the way we were before. Tens of thousands of residents here in Puerto Rico still have no power, and now they're having to get ready for Maria. It's a lot for this island to handle. Back to you, Matt and Savannah. <sighs> just too much. Tammy, thank you very much. Hello, Today fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.